<laughs> Do you guys even know how my day has been? Okay, this is really terrible, harsh lighting, but I'm trying to do this in a one take because it is 9.47 my time, which means it's probably late for some of you, your time, but I've had the craziest day. So I've been substitute teaching on the side, if you guys didn't know that, and I was at a middle school today, so I had to be at school at 8 o'clock, so I got to school at 8. And then right after school, I had a cheer lesson. So I ran and did a cheer lesson. Right after the cheer lesson, Cooper had a baseball game. So I had to run and buy him some treats for his game. And so I ran and got treats. And then I went straight to his game. And then I hadn't worked out yet. So I'm like, I got to go to the gym. So then I ran to the gym and worked out with my friend Stephanie. And I just got home. And it's 10 o'clock at night. And I feel like there's laundry to do. I haven't I don't even think I've eaten any dinner or lunch. I feel like I've just been going, 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 and I haven't gotten my vlog up. So today, here's the vlog. Um, so my vlog camera, vlogging device, hee hoo, hee hoo, left it at Stephen Ryan's house, and he's so sweet, he overnighted it to me. So this is the last one take you're gonna see, I swear it. So my camera should be here tomorrow. Um, so yeah, today's vlog is going to be about that quick booty warm-up workout that I wanted to show you guys. Seriously, guys, you should still watch this and you should still do this because it's such a good way to target every muscle in your lower half. And I did this for a month and I seriously noticed the biggest difference in my inner thighs, my butt, everywhere. So jump up, put the food down, put it down. Put down the ice cream, put down the pizza. Get up and do this with me really quickly. We're gonna run through it. And then we're gonna do quote of the day, and then we're gonna do random dancing of the day. Are you guys ready? Okay, so um, I have on five pound, I think these are five pound. I either, no, these are, I, yeah, these are five pound ankle weights, just to make it a little bit harder. If you wanna make it harder. Um, we are going to start with some center squats. So we come to here, okay, booty is going back. Don't let your knees go over your toe, we go straight down. We're going for 20, ready? One. Two, I'm not pregnant, it's just the shirt. Three, and it's getting dark. Four, five, and six, seven, and eight, nine, squeezing as you come up, 10, pulling your hips forward, 10, nine, good, keep going. Eight, pull your abs in tight, seven, squeeze them in, six, get low, five, up, four, up, whoo, three, squeeze, two, last one, one. Good, okay, those are center squats. Next, we're moving to Bulgarian squats. All you need is a chair or somewhere to put your foot. Sorry, I don't know where to put the camera. Um, do I look like I'm a, like an 80s instructor with this half top on? Woo-hoo. So we're gonna put our foot up. I'm putting my foot on the window sill. You guys can grab a chair. We're going to be doing 15 Bulgarian squats, just going down, two, and three. Molly, where are you? Four, five, and six. Good, seven, eight. I just lifted legs today, so this is super killer. 10, five more, five, up, four. If I can do it, so can you. Three, two, last one. One, switch sides, okay? So your leg's just going up on something. You're coming out and you're squatting down. One and two. And the best thing about this, you need no equipment. You don't have to have ankle weights. It's just something good to have if you want it. Seven, eight, we have seven more. Come on, seven, up, six, up, five, up, squeeze the booty, up, three, up, two, and one, okay? So 20 center squats. 15 on each leg. Next, we're going to, don't be perverted about these, hip raises. So we're gonna be laying on the floor. I'm out of breath. Bum is down, hands are planted, ankles are as close to your bum as you can get them. We are going to lift up for three and hold, and then come back down for 10 times. So up, hold one, two, three, and down, go up. Squeezing here so tight. Down, one, two, three, and down, up, two, three, hold. It's gonna target our glutes 
and our inner thighs, two, three, and up, two, we're doing 10, I don't know where we're at, I think we're halfway, up, two, three, and up, two, three, and up, two, three, two more, one, two, three, and one, two, three, good, okay, after those, we are going to do single leg press-ups. So same idea, bum. Molly, bring me some water. Bum is down, hips are down, one leg is up. Okay, sorry, I'll scoot back. And arms are down, we're just pressing up for 10. Nine, heel is driving up towards the ceiling. Eight, seven, six, get it girl. Five, or boy, four, three, Pressing two plus one, one, and switch. Ready, go. 10, press it up. Nine, whoo, eight, seven, six, five, as high as you can go. Four, three, two plus one, one. Good. Okay, now we flip it over, and this foot is gonna come up and press for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five. I look so 80s right now. Three, two, and one. Switch. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Okay, last but not least, I like to call this the McDonald's arch. So, after we do those press ups, um, hands and knees, same thing. Leg starts out here. We're gonna make it go up and over like an arch. So up, one. We're doing five, two, and three, up and over. Four, try to keep that leg straight, Carly. Five, <sighs> switch, ready? Legs out, let's go. One, two, good, three, two more, four, and five. Okay, and that's it. Um, whew. So, the goal is to do that every single day for 30 days, and tell me if you don't notice that your legs are getting tighter, your thighs are getting tighter, your booty is getting tighter and getting lifted, plus you're moving your body. And I'm seriously gonna pass out. <sighs> just kidding. Um, I just feel like I've been going, going, going all day. But I love you guys, and I wanted to get you that booty workout. So I want you to try it, and start with those numbers, That's, those are good starting numbers, and then um, after three days of doing that, try to increase your numbers by five, okay? And tell me how you feel. Tell me if you like it, tell me if you feel the burn. These single leg press ups, so hard. And these ones, I usually do 20 of these, okay? Cause those are really gonna work this area for women, which we all don't really love. Um. So yeah, 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 yeah. I love you guys. Am I going a million miles an hour? I'm so sorry. I'm looking for my quote of the day. I found a really good one and I wanted to share with you guys. Cooper did so good in his baseball game. He hit three for three and it's so funny. You can tell he's been raised by a cheer mom because he got to first base and when he got it, he goes, yay! And he jumped up and down like this and it was the funniest thing ever. Okay. So yeah, Cooper did good today. And Molly is upstairs playing because she was hanging out with Grandma Laura and Grandpa Carl's and she was playing with Kobe all night. So she's wiped out. Um, here is today's quote of the day. You will find that it is necessary to let things go simply for the reason that they are heavy. So true, so true, so true. The best advice I could give you guys is to figure out in your life what is important to you and what you need to keep in your life. I feel like if it's not helping you grow or strengthen you, if it's not developing you as a person and who you see yourself becoming, then it's just holding you back and it's weighing you down. There's so many things in our daily lives that we um, 
go through, you know, maybe somebody offends us and we, we put that in our backpack and we kind of carry that around with us where we get in a fight with somebody and we never really resolve it. We kind of put that in our backpack and, you know, we carry it around with us and soon enough, you know, there's so many things in our backpack and it's just weighing us down and it feels so hard to get up and move into function and it changes us, you know, it, it changes who we are, it changes what we see, it changes how we feel about ourselves and, you know, it's, I feel like that's my mantra is like coming back to just really finding, finding who it is you are internally, not phys physically, not where you belong, not how smart you are, but your heart, finding out what's on the inside and really loving that. And just everything else can fall away because what you love on the inside is going to radiate on the outside. It's going to make you be a better person, a better um, co-worker and in all aspects and areas of your life. So whatever it is that you are holding on to, I want you to drop it and let it go tonight. Tonight is the last night for you to even think about it, carry about it, worry about it, whatever. Get it out of your backpack, empty it out, lighten up the load so that tomorrow you can move smoother and lighter and you can feel better about yourself because honestly, you deserve it and I'm not even lying about that. Um, for those of you who want to know about the nails, I got this color at Walmart. It's Essie and it's called Underwear. Is that so funny? So funny. Okay, today's Random Dancing. Are you ready? I just downloaded this song and I love it so much. If you can't tell, I'm still out of breath because I have not been able to catch up all day. Ooh, I want to eat some ketchup right now. P.S. Who is going to vlogger flare? Mish, 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 mish. Who's going to vlogger fair in Seattle June eighth and 9th? I'm going. Are you going? Let's meet up. Okay, Kelly Clarkson. People like us. I want you guys to go in your rooms, put on your headphones, turn the song up, and listen to it because I dedicate it to you. Are you ready? It kind of sounds like at first Lady Gaga, but it's not. It's Kelly Clarkson. My hip just popped. Okay. I think it's like a good move. I feel like I could do that in the club. Would that be cool in the club? What about this one? No? Okay, seriously. I'm done. But go, go and listen to that song because it goes along with that message. I'm going to leave everything we talked about in this video in the description because I've been talking so fast. I feel like you guys are like, Carly, what the H-E double toothpicks. Slow down. Anyways, Bill vlog is going to be up. I love you guys. Tomorrow, I'm going to have my mom telling you guys a story about me so she can embarrass me for a good 10 minutes or so. Um, maybe I'll wash my hair. Maybe I won't. Anyways, I love you, and I'm going to lick your elbow someday. Mm.